Now, the thing about your veranda is that it protects the space. But of course, the problem is there's no privacy. So then, uh, what I tried to do is, I realized that if you had um, um, the veranda thing, oh, thank you very much. Center button, okay. And then you, you could have, uh, in the split level, you could have uh, interlocking apartments. Or if you draw them to scale, you can see there are two levels at one end and one level at the other, and two here and one there. And this is a terrace garden which protects the, the, the building. Th this is a building in Bombay, I'm sorry, I should tell you, Kanchenjunga. And then by having sometimes two levels and two levels, you get different sized apartments, but you always get the, the terrace gardens which become the focus of the apartment, and each one goes all the way through from one end to the other. This is the plan. I won't look much. This is how the bedrooms are on top. This is overlooking the city with the diagonal. Look across. That's the breeze going through. Now, the shape of this building, so we're talking about climate, not designing a... I mean, this is what I found out in tradition, that the very shape of the building was to deal with, with this issue. And they didn't, what we do today is design something and then uh, let the mechanical engineer solve the problem. Or otherwise, even um, you just use low E glass or something and get a lead certification. Uh, the thing is that the, the, when you do that, you don't allow your own imagination to respond. So these are the two lines of defense. That's the building. It's really a high-rise building in the middle of a high-rise section of Bombay. <laughs>